What is up guys, it's me boy Kwis and we are back again with another video and as you can see we'll be playing the martial law right now. What's quite interesting is you know we have the Leroy custom, the mod to go on law and we're playing against Leroy in, in our waiting screen which is good as well because beating up on Leroy always makes me feel good um, just because how much I hate this character. So once again I do have to extend my thanks to you guys for the support recently it honestly has been crazy on YouTube and on Twitch you know things have been looking really 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 good recently um this has just been a very good year in general to be honest you know hit the 10k that was big for me I wanted 10k before the end of the year we got that um Twitch partner like when I think back this year has actually been quite a good year uh for me and it's been you know, it's, it's been really, really nice to have and you guys have been supporting so amazing. I have to thank you guys for that, seriously. Um, however, I've been looking at my analytics and a lot of you guys watching my videos are still not subscribed. Come on, guys. You need to come on. Come on now, just hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Come on, you guys are better than that. I know it. Yeah, back to the good stuff. Um, You guys have seriously, seriously, seriously been great this year. I mean, the thing, the thing about this year is like... While it has been personally quite a good year for myself, um, it's been quite hard to enjoy because uh, this has been quite a dog shit year in general, to be honest. You know, obviously due to COVID just shut. I mean, this year started off in a bad, on a really bad front. I mean, remember when Australia was on fire? Uh, yeah, that was at the start of this year. Remember that, you know? This this year has, has not been a good one on on like a general scale. But personally, things have been going good for me. But it's really hard to enjoy when you know the world the world is basically falling apart. <laughs> and actually, I might not be able to play this game. I have a mod. Uh oh. See, this is why. Okay, I have a mod for geometric plane that puts into green screen, but. I might not be able to play this game because you cannot use the mod online. Um, okay, we can, we can actually play, but there might be, there might be some form of desync here just because um, I'm not too sure. You're not supposed to use this mod online. You're really not. And it makes me really worried for, um, <laughs> for what's about to happen here. Like, um, because this mod doesn't have walls but the geometric plane has walls unless this person has the green screen mod which there's no reason to like whatever happens here i'll just play one game and leave after that just because i sh i need to remember to delete this mod i need to remember when i'm when i'm not um making content using tekken I'm really worried that like something's gonna happen. <laughs> like, the worst that could happen is like a desync or like the game just you get a comma. That's like the worst that could happen. But I'm kind of still worried past that because there's like a there's like an out of bounds stage state uh, on this mod. So if you go far enough, you kind of go off the map. And I hope that I hope that doesn't happen here. I'm just really just trying to get the seed. Look, there it is, right? But I'm pretty sure that's where a wall would be on this stage. So I just don't know. Yeah, I, th I think we've desynced. I think we might have desynced now because he just wasn't doing anything there. There we go. That's what I was worried about. I think I think going out of bounds is desync to us because he was just kind of staying down there and he's just getting hit by the jump guard. So like a real human being would have low parried at least one of those. So yeah, that was yeah, that's my bad. I should have remembered to remove the green screen mod. 
sorry about that. But I'm sure some of you may be asking yourself now, Kwis, why do you have a green screen mod? Um, well, as you guys might be able to tell recently, I'm doing different things with my thumbnails. Um, I've been working. I recently just decided to fuck it. I'm going to download Photoshop. Um, it's going to make, it's going to just open doors for me in terms of what more I can do in terms of like just content creation. Um, thumbnails was like my primary focus and you know I think I've been doing a good job with my thumbnails quite recently as well um so yeah it's it's the green stream mod is to get like different shots and stuff like that that I can use to make my thumbnails with which is why I have that mod as you can imagine um one of my favorite thumbnails I've done so far with it is the army king thumbnail I'm a big fan of that army king thumbnail that I did um I'm probably going to put it on the screen right now just because I'm so proud of it. And it's like my favorite thumbnail to date. Like I don't, I do not have a single mod, a uh, thumbnail I like more than that one. Another pool. I'm playing a lot of pool recently. Pool is just a character you don't see very often. When you do see him, you see him a lot. All right, then let's see. Let's see what we can expect. What a what? Okay. It's an interesting custom. Ooh, the whiff punish. Clean. Oh, I was so late on that, but it's okay. I could have got a better combo there as well. Not what I wanted. 12. Is that minus 12? I'm for two. No, he's not doing it. Okay. Paul is one of those characters, and I'm probably going to have a debate about this on one of my streams. Um, probably in my stream, either today or tomorrow, I'm going to have a debate about this with the, with the stream. Because Paul is one of those characters who, for my money, is undoubtedly top five. Ugh. Undoubtedly top five. Like, he just kills you off almost any time. Um, he kills you with almost any touch, and he's down for two. He has, he has good evasion as well, which a character like him just doesn't need. An argument I saw cropping up recently was an argument that people have always sort of had, and I've always, I always disagree with this argument. I always disagree with it. But people have like sort of been saying, well, if Paul is so good. Why isn't he winning every single tournament? Why isn't he in, in the tournament? Why aren't the top players winning with him in tournament? Blah, blah, blah. And that's an... Uh, I want to have like a debate about that argument because I don't personally don't really agree with it. That's my standpoint on it. I don't agree with that argument. Like just because a character's good doesn't mean they're going to... Every single person is going to play them in the tournament. The only time we have seen that really is Leroy. That's the only time we've seen a character that is so good that people just have to pick him, right? If you didn't pick him, you were, at, you were at a disadvantage. That's why everyone picked him at EVO Japan, which was this year, when you think about it. Like, it feels like so long ago, but that was this year, 2020. Um, like, I think one of the perfect examples of that is Devil Jin. Devil Jin has been top tier since like the start of this game, but the only person who has really been playing the character and you know doing anything with the character on a global scale has been kudan's kudan's been the only devil gin loyalist right obviously knee has picked him um every so often kakoma has picked him every so often mm, that shoulder's so stupid um they pick the character every so often but you know people not picking him doesn't prove anything about his him not being strong and i think I just don't like I just don't like the debate of if this character is so good, why is it why are they not winning every single tournament, right? And even still, like Nice if we go back to Paul, like Knee picks Paul, Kokoma picks Paul. Like yes, there aren't many Paul mains, I guess, but he is used by the top characters. And at the end of the day, my argument will always be players win tournaments, characters don't. Obviously some characters like Fak and Leroy and Akuma. You know, they 
they can fall under that but for the most part it's it's a player's thing and i think people just put too much stock on characters being good rather than players it's something that i myself personally deal with because whenever i do well there's there's a little uh section of people that come and say well Huaring is so da -da 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 -da. Ew, chaos is winning tournaments now must be that Huaring. he's like you know Ooh, I, that was a very unfortunate high to go for there. If he went for the mid, it wouldn't have been. Actually, no, he was dead either way, to be honest. Oh, I was trying to be fancy with my combo. Go again. Go again. All right, now we just be patient. I have a huge life lead now. Don't have to risk anything. He has to make all the risks now. That's fine. I can take that. I ducked that. Maybe I didn't. Ooh, I should have punished that. It just looked like it hit, right? Wait for the... There we go. He just kind of had to, like, chip me down there and, you know... Ooh, he's still doing it, though. I respect it. Law has such cool combos, you know. Right, he's just sort of swinging for the fences now. Here comes the aggression. This is the typical aggressive pull that you expect, right? I think I can kill him with a wild sending two here. He's going to be so worried about the slide. Nope. He wasn't ducking anyway. I lied. I was, I was completely wrong. I was completely wrong. If I went for that, I could have died. But here we go. If I went for that, I could have died. <laughs> completely wrong. <read. laughs> I, am, I am right like 30% of the time on those reads. This is a classic matchup, though. Law versus Paul, right? Those of you who know your tech and history will know the, the lore behind these two characters. Ow. Um. There we go. He's kind of just whiffing when he doesn't have to. Mm, drop the combo there. He's kind of whiffing when he doesn't have to, and he's just giving me opportunities to... Ugh. I guess you can't low parry from me. Must have been two plus. Oops. He's kind of overextending when he doesn't have to a lot of times. Bop, bop. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a messed up slide from me. He's not ducking much actually. Oops, messed up that slide. There's the demo man. Will he do it again? I ducked. I didn't hold it though. I must have. I don't know why my duck. I don't know. I don't know, man. Hot kick. <laughs> Neutral hot kick. That wasn't what I wanted. I fucked up the input. Ah! I thought that might drop. I messed up the input. And it still worked out. Law's hot kick's a weird input. If you hold it, you get flip kick. You have to like tap up forward with it next tap up forward and you tap the four bar and it's weird it's very weird i thought i thought he didn't have the range for that to hit you know oh nice mm -mm -mm. He's going to end it with a low, so let's just... We really dick jab there? Really? Really? That was kind of crazy. Oh, no. He didn't... <gasps> no Punisher is fine. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Am I dead? I could be dead. Oh no, he dropped it. I think he wants to QCF3 me. Can I just interrupt you? I didn't do that. 
<laughs> oh, that's the worst misinput in all of history, man. There's all oh, dash up rage art okay. Okay. Let me just move past it. Man said rage art okay. <laughs> Fuck's sake. See, the thing is here, when I open up with a life lead. Oh no, I'm too plus four. He kind of gets a bit more jittery. It just forces it just forces him to come to me. Remember when quarter circle back four was fucking plus three on block? Oh my god. I wanted armored shoulder. Now this is something Paul Phoenix definitely does not need. Why does he have the rage art cancel? Obvious. That rage art cancel is so stupid. Sometimes you just gotta let it rip like double. Yep. Ooh, that was almost ugly. Oh, I, I actually launched punish the shoulder. I'm proud of myself. Up, up, up. I'm just gonna flip kick. Oh, <laughs> it's like he knew and it was like, no, the down one. It's like he knew. It's not going to stop me from doing it again, though. I hope you know this. The double. The double flip kick to end it. It's just not, you just can't stop me. Can never stop me. Maybe like the most passive fall I've ever played, you know. It's like when, when I am on, never mind. <laughs> never mind. He just mashed off the one, two. I take, I take it back immediately. Minus 12. I said it in my head, like, after blocking it. Where's that low? See that shoulder, man. If I did, if I did anything else, that well, oh my God. Oh my. Okay, he fucked up. It's fine. Oh. I like his use of down one. It kind of just, it, it stuffed the full crouch mix up there, right? And it's really good at keeping me in check. Yeah, that was good. It's just good. It's just keeping me in check really well with it. Oh my gosh. Okay, now the mashing comes out. Yeah, he tried again. I used to do back four that time because he just kept trying to interrupt legend kick. And legend kick is like plus seven on block. See, now, now he's learned his lesson. Nice. Mm -mm -mm. The tracking, excuse me? Mr. Phoenix. The range too, oh my God. Oh, I swear I down for two first. Is he really challenging forward one plus two? Watch the damage. Hmm, stop challenging. Nice. Oh, this is going to the wall. Nice combo. Ooh. 
Oh, that's annoying. I thought I'd get the wolf for a combo, but I was just left in fucking DSS. Oh boy. He's not challenging Dragon Hammer anymore. Oh my gosh, I didn't punish. I was too fixated on fucking Dragon Hammering him. I didn't punish at all. Good with punish. Bad legend kick from me. Oh my god, the shoulder is so stupid. It's so ridiculous. Why does Paul Phoenix of all characters have an evasive shoulder? It's so ridiculous. Yeah, he keeps pushing off the one, two. I'll just, I'll just counter hit him for it. For that, I'm, I'm still heated about that shoulder. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. It was a cell. <laughs> it was a cell. I'll just say it was a cell. Shoulder? Oh, no. He's... He is mashing a lot when I'm... When I'm plus. Oh, that does what do. Dead? Paul did not need that 3 2 sway back, man. I don't know why each season they keep buffing Paul. <laughs> don't know. And if you're going to buff Paul, the one thing you do not buff is his fucking damage. <laughs> I have no idea why they added that 3 2 sway back. He really commits to mashing off the legend kick, you know. That kills Japs. Oh, what was that pushback? <laughs> Just had a dog bark outside, scared the life out of me. But no, what the hell was that pushback? <laughs> I'm like, yes, it's time to punish. Three plus four, four. And then I just see, like, I'm dashed halfway across the screen. Like, and that's one thing I really want nerfed about Paul. The death fist. Just ridiculous death fist pushback like that. I think death fist in itself, let have some pushback, sure. But not like that. All right, let's make this the last one. He's really committing to one, two buttons. That's fine. I think the next time he does one two, I do down forward two. It should work. Oh, I thought I'd be fast enough there. Oh, that sucks. But dropping the combo there also sucks. <laughs> that was so obvious. <laughs> that was so obvious. Why would I do that? Oof. Oh, no. Who's this up? No. That's one thing I've noticed. A lot of people after toe kicks, they normally get up and push buttons straight away. Straight away. It's a very online thing, I think. Yeah, that kills jabs, okay? It's consistent. It's tech. Nice start. Oh, 
Oh my god. If I didn't drop that, the Oki, I would have killed him with Oki. That's okay, he's dead now. No, he's not, because I dropped the combo. But of course he ducked. I've been sliding a lot. GG's to this man. Very strange fall. Very strange. But that's kind of the thing like uh, nowadays. We're into a lot of strange falls. It's quite passive. And then I just couldn't read him. I can't lie. I could not read that guy at all. Sometimes he was passive. Sometimes he was aggressive. Mashing when he shouldn't be. It was working sometimes. Then it wasn't. But it is what it is. That's Tekken. That's online. You play the game. You have fun. You play different people. And also, you guys enjoy my videos. And thank you for that. So if you enjoy, please like this video. It's free. Also, subscribe, comment, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.